Ty, the transport guy, hanging out in the transport parking lot with my best friend, Lawrence Moore. What's up? High five in <laughs> We caught Lawrence in Georgia, making Georgia. Georgia. I was in, uh, where was I at? Valdosta? Valdosta, Georgia. Valdosta? Yeah. Valdosta, yep. Valdosta, Georgia. Meet you on the way, been in touch. We've got Jack Cooper and four vets. Doing, uh, we're getting ready to take off. We already did the pre-trip, checked everything, but we're just going to do a quick walk around. Show us what you got. Straps. Yeah. How many Corvettes you got on here? We got 10. 10? That's a lot of money. We got a million dollars on here. That's great. Jack Cooper. Hi, you know. Pacho. Dave Count Volvo. All the power. I wonder if the D means Detroit. <laughs> Checking our tires, making sure our straps are good. <clears throat> Nothing moved while we were taking a nap. Right. I like how you got this set up high. I'm going to go with the reason for this is so we're not eating up rocks. rocks in yeah, all that. The higher, the better for this situation. That's we nice. used to get about 11. You used to could put 11 on here? Yeah. What did you change? Because of the engines in the back, the new ones. Huh. Yeah. You only do uh, 10 because of the weight. <clears throat> How is the... Uh... Because of the weight. Sorry, I just went yeah. blank. 11, that's still a lot. How much do these weigh? A Corvette, one Corvette. These are what, 2022s? Yeah. Uh, about 5,000. It's got to be close to that. Oh, you can see there's a blue one. You can't see the color. There's a white. Yeah. It's nice. Keep going here. <clears throat> Everything's still strapped, looking good. And now, do the, these don't all go to one stop, right? It's I got six drops. Six drops? Yep. One pickup, six drops. Yep. That's good. They're a little stingy with the Corvettes. When you pull in and you got Corvettes, I mean, I've been on LinkedIn. I'm watching everybody talk about how when these guys pull in with anything, mm -hmm. everybody gets excited. But tell us what happens when you pull in with a Corvette. Oh, the whole the whole dealership comes out. <laughs> yeah. They're All pretty the excited. sales managers and... Yeah, GMs and, you know, the whole dealership comes out. It's their hot commodity right here. The Corvettes are hot? Yeah. So when you show up, everybody's like, oh, and yeah. Warren, you're a rock star. Rock star. Rock yeah. star, and they love watching you unload. Oh, yeah, definitely. And really, honestly, I mean, I know it's Corvette, but it's still a car. Yep, right? yep, yep, still a car. Still the basic supply. Yep. Go slow. But they're all sold out for the year. The Corvettes? Yeah. Every one of them? Every one of them. So they're on a wait list. So when I come, you know, they've been oh. waiting. Some people have been waiting for years. One year, two years, yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Definitely. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's a lot of waiting. Chip shortage. <clears throat> Chip you shortage know. and everybody wants their car. Yep. I wonder, did you know if they had to order these online to get them? Yeah. They did. And then they get a number. Number. Wait, so like a Tesla a wait deal? list number. Yep. <laughs> Hang on. All right. Let's look underneath. Wow. Look at that. You don't get to see the underneath of a Corvette every day. Wrong way. Let's try this right there. Look at that. <clears throat> Does that stay on there? What's that? All that? Yep. Does it really? Yep. Wow. You could do some serious off road with that. <laughs> Carbon fiber? Is that carbon fiber up there? Oh. So this is the, oh, this is the back because the engine's in the rear now. Yeah. Right? <laughs> I'm learning a little bit today. <clears throat> wow. So this guy, you got a ways to go. Big day coming up. Yep. Head to Miami. Miami? Miami. We say Miami from where I am. <laughs> Miami, Miami. <clears throat> Six stops. You got a long way to go. Well, I appreciate you taking the time to show us everything. I'm going to let you go. Have a great day.